While many people think golfers are the biggest target for a lightning strike, more people are killed by lightning while they're boating, fishing, even mowing the lawn. Florida is the lightning strike capital of the country, with as many as 50 people killed by lightning since 2006. And while many people believe that golfers are the biggest target, that's a myth. Much of the credit for keeping golfers safe are lightning detection devices that alert golfers when to leave the links. We installed these probably three or four years ago. The range on them is 10 miles. If there's a lightning strike, you'll get one loud blast that will let you know we're under lightning warning. And then after we haven't had any lightning for 30 minutes, you get three short blasts that let you know that you're all clear to go back out. But even if you're stuck far from the clubhouse or anywhere where lightning threatens, there are a few tips you can use to keep you safe. Don't stand under a tree. If you're under it, you're gonna get struck. Just like this guy did a few weeks ago. In fact, Put as much distance as you can between you and the tree. A safe structure doesn't mean a beach cottage, porta potty, or golf cart barn. It means going to a substantial building with plumbing, electricity, and somewhere you can stay safe. Don't lay flat on the ground. Because you're just increasing your contact with the ground. When lightning strikes, it spreads out in a spiderweb pattern. Laying on the ground is not safe. As an absolute last resort, you can do the lightning crouch. Get on the balls of your feet, Touch your heels together and make yourself as small as possible. The National Weather Service doesn't necessarily recommend this anymore, but if you're out in the middle of nowhere, you gotta do what you gotta do. Another lightning myth is that it's attracted to metal, like golf clubs. If anything, it's the action of swinging a golf club that attracts the lightning because it makes you the tallest object in the field. Bottom line is, when thunder roars, go indoors.